1993. Nintendo presents. Nineteen ninety three. Nintendo presents. Nineteen ninety three. Nintendo presents. Listen. Nintendo presents. Town. Nintendo presents.
Nintendo presents Well, um, so my predictions is that this is going to be an incredibly rough challenge. Uh, it's going to start out simplistic for about the first four bosses, and then I'm going to slowly look for a rope to tie a noose with, to rope it around the, uh, the power pole outside so that I can just hang myself because that's where this challenge is going to go oh I didn't mean to fire yet I'm going to reset the game so yeah this is going to make me hate living especially towards the latter bosses if you thought Schneider was bad when I did uh um, release a quack and thank you so much for the host. If you thought that uh, Schneider was bad from the first game, Virvius and Cobra and Arachnus and Gigadesp. Hey, JCW. And oh, yeah, that would help, Derp. Interesting note about this game, it is the only game to contain a specific chip to allow it to have some of the big bosses that it does. Alright, alright, I'll go through roll call, I'll say hi to everybody, hi Admiral, hi Derp Dog, hi Cal Calico, hi JCW, hi Tank Catapult, I think those are the only, and uh, hi Quacken because you hosted me. Hey, Arcane Foo. Moister than an oyster? I like that. I'll have to remember that phrase. Alright, now I gotta remember how to do this. Lord Armand83, thank you so much for the host. Was it this one? JCW, thank you so much for the host. No, this was not the right code. So that means it was the other code. There's two codes to this game. If you hit LABL on the title screen, it'll bring you to actually input the name. Uh, my week has just been... shit. I think it was B-A-L-L. -L. We'll find out, I guess. I believe it was. I believe I just turned on real mode. Okay, so interesting little thing that I never showed off in the Let's Play of this is if you press, I think it's Y. Um, Airhammer, thank you so much for the host. If you press uh, X or Y, one of the two, on the main screen with the controller, you actually get a uh, menu that you can check out. Um... Yeah, so like you can pull up the time trials, you can pull up all sorts of stuff, you can pull up the individual stages, um, if it falls within the proper rule set, so like, which means you only get one bomb, 
Uh, so, like for example, let's go here to Virius 1, right? There's no records, even though I've beaten the game clearly on the Let's Play twice with both Falcon and Tornado because I used more than one bomb, so... Also use more than one bomb on this bitch, too. Mario Paint? Probably not. Um, I never really considered doing anything with Mario Paint at all. So yeah, it's it's a pretty neat mode. Um, you can also check out your class or what ranks you have. So I've got like one completion as being uh, a fox, which is a lieutenant. Um, it doesn't have any of the others. Basically, the faster you beat the game, the faster and higher up you go on this ranking list. And there are 32 ranks going all the way down to Sloth down here. I actually do not know what the number one rank in this game is. I've never been able to get it. Uh, so... But you can press fire and actually control this with the super scope as well. So we're going to get out of this menu and we're going to play the game now. Yep, we unlocked it. That's why it's red. No, we're not going to continue. Real mode high. As Falcon. I am so not ready for this. It wins Monster Hunter. I don't know. Here we go. Yes. Garam is gold. Everything in real mode high is gold colored. Oh god, I didn't make a safe state, so I have to reset the game. Ah, oh, great! We're off to a great start. Ah, oh, it's so good. One day in a different timeline. Deus, thank you so much for the host. File, save, game position, do slot, nine. This is gonna suck. His weakness is like right here in the very dead center, but the only way to get to his weakness is to hit him with a triple charge shot with three full lanterns. Oh boy. Okay, that's something. Okay, that, when he jumps, that's how you actually get to his weakness. This is gonna suck, isn't it? It's gonna suck, isn't it? 
It's gonna suck, isn't it? <laughs> oh God, help me. Wait, for real? I don't have to play my cleric? I was kind of looking forward to trying a cleric. Um, where was my shot? Or did I just wait too late and nothing came out? What are you playing in it? What have I done exactly, Derp? No damage. Fortunately, this the first couple of bosses should be easier. You suck. On my own stolen channel. Uh, but what are you playing, Deus? medical doctor. I might just hang on to the cleric. I don't know. We'll see. I can believe I died. I can't take any damage. Are you serious? He actually went for the full charge on that. Uh. Yeah, this is gonna this is gonna end up being the, a nine or a ten in difficulty, isn't it? Testicle. What? Okay, sure, it didn't. Went, went right through my slow shot. I don't think her laptop is as old as my PC is.
Really? The little shot got past me. Also, I feel like the mouse is not as responsive for some reason. It might be just me, though. I want to know where my shot went. This is already proving to be... Yeah, my shot vanished along with my sanity. And you know what's next? Alien Vendetta with Project Brutality. Let's just bring the pain on. No! Tiny shot, no. I'm trying to hang on to bombs. I need to keep a stock of five so when I get to uh, Velius, I can just flatline him. Wait, what? I didn't see anything hit me. Six ever. Dude, no. Map 25 is not even my concern. 26 is my concern. Wait, I didn't... Oh, my God. Get my head in the game here. He's gonna have... A, implying I haven't already. Dude, I don't know, man. That Mega Man X challenge was just batshit. I have to I had to use the bomb. I was gonna get hit if I didn't. No, are you no? shot oh my god I forgot he could do the double freaking fist detach in this game fucking double rocket punch This is boss one of about, let's see, Garam, Siamang, 
Wong, Viscount, Viscount, whatever. No, Griffin, then Viscount. Then Thanatos, Arachnus, Cobra, Groken, Virvius. 13? 13 or 14? Thirteen is a lucky number, right? Hey, Lord Pantyhose. But at least the graphics and the sound and everything is better in this game. Let's just hope he doesn't double rocket punch again. Something right. I know I fired before that. See, what makes this hard is they weave a lot more in this uh, game on the harder difficulty. They don't fire, like, bullets at rapid speed, but uh, they weave a lot more. It makes them harder to hit. It makes their shots harder to hit. Fired too soon. That's a really tight window of just a couple of frames. Rocket punch! Fired. I waited till the second lantern ticked and then fired. I should have fired it sooner. Almost tank. Almost. He almost added it. There you go. Rocket punch. Oh, nice. Okay, that's something. You f ah! 15 minutes on Garam is not what I was expecting here. What have I done to myself? By the way, this challenge actually means a lot to me because I love this game. Didn't have enough time to charge. I think at this point we all lose. Yeah, it's going to be hit. I knew that was a bad run. For some reason, I feel like if he goes to the left, I'm a little bit better off. Planes, like airplanes. Oh my god, how did I miss the single purple shot? 
Four seconds, guys. It's like a new record. Bring it, Garam. Sudden jerk to the left. Hey, Boleslav. I didn't have enough time to finish it off, uh, finish off that one, uh, weak shot before he came at me with a power ball. He came in like a power ball. See, I never know... The, the AI is a lot better in this game. That sudden jerk to the left. That sudden jerk to the left. You... Cock goblin... Fucking... Chode gargler. Hey, Rincewind, what's up? I'd like some sudden jerk. I wish we all would like some sudden jerk. Oh my god, I missed with the triple charge. Okay, I hit a hand, that's fine. Woo, that was close. Okay, I took the arm off. Nope! No rocket punch for you. Yeah, first boss down. I had to use the bomb, though, because he was going to rocket punch. In this game, I don't think you can single lantern through a rocket punch. It takes all three lanterns, and you don't get the time to charge in hard mode. <laughs> Sudden stroke with a soft voice. Maybe I should start doing AMR ASMR streams. Hello, this is Ultima Mantoid, and today we have this ASMR video. We have this crinkling bag. Enough of that. <laughs> I violated. <laughs> Alright, so that boss is done. Save position 8. Maybe I should start doing ASMR videos. Who would actually watch me do ASMR? Oh god. Okay, so this is Siamang. This is the uh, adoptive blood brother, quote unquote, of Garam. His weakness is his tail, so if I can actually hit his tail... 
Oh, crap! Woo! That was close. Oh, I blocked it? Jeez. I can't even hit him. He's so friggin' thin. It's like fighting Lorca 2.0, but this time with a tail. And yes, when you hit Siamang, it sounds like a monkey. Are you serious, you fucking monkey? Oops, I accidentally changed the, uh... Uh, give me a second. Window size. There we go. Accidentally screwed up my window size. <laughs> Lord Pantyhose, thank you so much for the host. Puggo is the best fucking emote on this channel. And yes, this this robot is a it's a monkey, and he does taunt the shit out of you. Okay, that didn't block. Oh nope, wrong save. Yes, uh, retweet the stream on Twitter. Try and get people to come in and hang out. I would like to hopefully get affiliate on Twitch so I can maybe get you guys a subscription badge? How would you like that? Stop backflipping! Meep. 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 I hit him in the leg and it like stopped him cold. That was neat. Bleep, bleep. What was that? I don't remember him doing that. What was he just like nope? Oh my god. Well, the thing is, a subscription, if I ever got a subscription badge. Dude, the butt slapping is amazing. He fucking flips over it every time! That's a good hit. That's a good hit. This game will keep you on the defensive. It's a lot different than Battle Clash. Whew, that was close. Having to use bombs! I need to have bombs for Virvius! 
or he is going to roast me. see a giant robot hippo okay this one might go a little bit better because if i can hit the shields it'll force him to turn and it'll actually show his weakness um he's got three weaknesses let's see if i can actually blow him up uh, my record beating this guy on normal mode is like six seconds this is what i mean like if i can just hit his arm and i realize i got hit don't worry but that's the whole thing. Like, if you get a three a three lantern and you hit one shield, the impact causes him to turn, which reveals his weakness, which is his elbow. Damn, dude, me too. So yeah, this takes place in the Great Wall of China. I've never been able to blow up his little anti-gravity device, so I don't even know if it's possible. Oh my god, it slipped right by. Fuck. Honestly, I would like to think that Bruce Wayne's like a trillionaire. Because, I mean, how much money has he sank into being Batman? I'm going to eventually route this game for speedruns, too. That barely blocked. just gonna have to pick at him I guess shit <sighs> except for sex Nothing like Batman. So it's like you're actually nothing like Batman. Okay. Still cannot, no matter how late I delay that. And see here, I was thinking this whole time I could be able to get to the weaknesses. Nah, they're covered. They're weaknesses. I can't get to them. I have watched this much TV. Um, I watched uh, Chopped, and that was like it. I like watched an episode of Chopped. That's the most TV I've watched in about five years.
because the cooking network is actually pretty fucking cool. Jeez, that uh, kind of surprised me. So, if you remember Scarab from the first game, he's kind of like Scarab 2.0. Okay, got him to 50%. Whoa! Oh my god, I forgot about that. He just... Brought... No, I'm not repeating it, pantyhose. Three really good shots. See, that's the thing that they added with this game. Penny hose. Penny hose. <laughs> You're now penny hose. <clears throat> ho ho. Oh ho no. They said ho ho. Like you were trying to be Santa. The good thing is, is anytime he fires his machine gun uh, from his shield, it's always four shots. <gasps> oh, crap. No! What the... Oh, my God! <sighs> the shield rotation attack. If 
fired too soon. See, this game, unlike Battle Clash, does not really give you a chance to be, uh... How, how long... Well, uh, how, how long do I estimate this one? Longer than Battle Clash. I'm going to guess about 14 to 15 hours. Most of that's going to be on Virvius. Whoa! Yep, he pulled the surprise mouth cannon. I'll be 30 before you finish this. Yes, his name is Wong. He's Chinese. You're fighting the Wong the Great Wall of China. can't stop that. That there's nothing I can do to stop that. Low you say. <laughs> That's surprise. <laughs> That's the whole point of Quacken though. He doesn't think before he speaks. That's what makes him great. Okay, I didn't move the cannon or the shot over far enough. I tell you what, the next boss is actually terrifying to think about, honestly, like to do this. Because the next one's Griffin. And you'll see why. Emmykins88, thank you so much for the, uh... Thank you so much for the follow. You're now an honorary mantoid in the fight against evil. Thank you. Sup, Nitrant? You're watching me get my ass handed to me by a thing that looks like a frog with round little arms that block shit. <clears throat> and has no legs. That was a good hit, though. Fired it, and then I was, I was like, oh, there's a space I can shoot at him. Skinamax soft for videos. Oh my god. If I just if I could charge a lantern a little bit faster there.
Shit. Too early. A deformed bell sprout. I don't even think it's a bell sprout. Like. We're at 43 minutes. Oh my god! That came out really fast! <laughs> I'm still single. What's the point? And yes, uh, just a reminder, we are, I think it's like $111.11 away from Mega Man X7. Or, $111.77. Something like that. We're some weird number away, so... can't even bomb that fast enough. If he opens his mouth, it's over. That's so fast. That is breakneck speed. And even then, I only have the one bomb. So, I can't stop his shield rotation. Not surprise. Too soon. Too soon. I didn't think Wong would be this difficult. I forgot he's got that stupid, I'm going to rotate my shield and just shoot a billion bullets at you. And we're going to turn it into a Danmaku.
fired it again too soon. I wonder. I want to try something. I got, a, I got a strategy. Let's see if this works. And I went back into old habits, so it doesn't matter. Uh, yes, you need the Super Scope for the SNES version. I have one, but I don't have the receiver, nor do I have a capture card. <clears throat> Alright, let's see if I can do this. I mean, if I get hit, I get hit, whatever. Nope, I still got hit, but whatever. At least it was worth trying to see if I could blow that thing up. That was super lucky. That was not, though. <clears throat> um, eBay's a place you can look. Amazon's a place you can look. Uh, G2K Gaming is a place you can look. Those come so fast. I had to bomb him again! I'm trying to save bombs. It's not happening. This sucks.
Babble. <coughs> There's just no way to block a spread of shots that wide that fast. So for those of you that remember Artemis from the first game... Nice, I hit a weakness. Shit. <clears throat> the cart is like five to ten dollars. Like, this game is not an expensive game. Uh, mostly because it was niche and obscure. But the Super Scope itself, you'll pay anywhere from, I've seen, $30 up to 250 So, just depends on how lucky you get. And it might help if I actually fire to defend myself. That would be fantastic. Also, hey, Sheikra, what's up? Oh my god, it just went right off screen. Oh my god. That that went super quick. Griffin was not okay. I forgot his weakness is as open and exposed as it is. This one, I'm not thinking will give me a hard time because, again, he has a very open and exposed weakness. But he still could surprise me. <clears throat> if y'all remember Baron... It's the same guy with the same damn standing tank, just bigger, heavier armored, bigger shield, and a bigger gun. No, I need to not miss that shot, period. I can't miss that shot at all. But I got to keep a bomb, so that's good. I have an extra bomb for Virvius now. Yes! Got him! Oh my god. Oh, and he can still do that. Lovely. Lovely. Look at him. Just, oh, I'm gonna go Super Saiyan or some shit. I don't know anymore.
No, I can't even stop. I gotta take those legs off. I can't miss. Hey, Forsaken Scholar. Oh my god. Sir Floof. Got him! Okay. Shit. Like, he's not hard. I can get him pretty quickly. It's just going to be a matter of not missing. Because his weakness is his legs. They're super frail. And when you take him off, he's just scooting along the ground while moving at high speeds. Shit. I don't know how I survived that rapid fire cannon like machine gun barrage, but I did. Yeah, I don't even have a death counter for these games because I know every time I die, it's just like, or every time I get hit, it's just ridiculous. I may go back through and actually count them later or something. <clears throat> but deaths are so rapid fire in this game. I mean, like, literally, a match can go to, like, six seconds, and then I can get hit. <laughs> See, if he goes to the left, it's a lot harder to hit him, because the long leg, like the one that's not folded up, is behind the shield and you can't really hit it. Why not Zoidberg? Oh no, why not Zoidberg? <clears throat> Good, he went to the right. Really? 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 The last shot! Really? Really? As long as my patience. <clears throat> I think when he's coming from, when he goes to the left, I need to try and hit that long leg. 
I only need a one bolt to take it out, so that's a good thing. So maybe I, I'm not completely screwed when he flies off to the left. I just have to actually hit it and not get shielded. Also, yes, my beard has gotten incredibly long. It's like down to here now. <laughs> I got him to stop, but I got hit. By the way, one hour hype. Dropping my spinner on my face. So it's, so it's, uh, that, is that your mood? No! I got the leg and they ate the stupid power shot! No! <sighs> hey, Friday Witch! Long time no see. How you been? I love this game too. It's like it is one of my top like ten SNES games ever. Huge <laughs> Milky Way is just a huge fidget spinner for God. Oh my God, that's great. How you been, Friday? Got it. <sighs> Traded blows. Dag it. I need to see. Aw, you have your own emote now. That's cute. That is super cute. Aw. I know that feeling. I know that feeling too well, Friday. I missed the leg. Great. Dude, that is super cool. Congrats. I'm happy for you. Well, to be fair, Tank, Rage is not a bad game until you beat it. It's a fun, it's a fun game, but it's bad when you beat it. Hey, it's something though. They're freaking adorable though. All of mine are FFZ emotes. I don't even have affiliate yet, so. But I'm not worried about it. I have never played a Fire Emblem game. I really should solve that problem. I do not. I've streamed several times in the last two weeks. This is basically going to amount to, do I hit leg one? Yes. Do I hit leg two? Yes. Don't fuck up. Oh my gosh, mascots big kid. That's so cute. It's to be stronger.
Shit! Fuck! Upper left corner. I checked. I didn't have it. Got him, okay. No! Can you stop doing that? That would be great. My god, come on. Do not lose it now. God, okay. Does your character look like he's seen some shit? Oh my god. Here we go. First true wall is right here. Surely you guys remember Thanatos. God, that came so fast. That was just like... Yes, Holy Mode 7. I love this level. If you think this one's impressive, wait till you see later on. Also, this guy has no weakness. Why are we on Mars? This isn't Doom. Because Thanatos is ruling with uh, ruling from Mars this time instead of the moon. See, last time we went to the moon, uh, which we still went to Moon Base Luna, which is where uh, Viscount was. This is going to be painful. This is only just Doom with more robots. Oh my gosh. Y'all are great.
Honestly, I'm making better time than I thought I was, though. But this is where I'm going to spend the next six hours of my life. No. Okay, that was a lot of fucking bullets. Just... Bullet vomit! Everywhere! But the good news is, is I have three bombs. I'm trying to save bombs. Because it will help me way later. And this is the moment that he knew. He fucked up. Could not get those bombs down fast enough. I couldn't hit them. If it wasn't for that special chip that they put in this game, it's only found in this game, uh, I don't think this game would even run because of the slowdown that it gets through. There's so much shit going on screen at one time, it's insane. got hit. I got hit on probably the same damn frame that I hit him with it. Take it easy for a second, Scholar. Get some rest, man. Have a good night. <laughs> MTX1996, thank you so much for the host. What's up, man? How you doing? Should have just fired it. I shouldn't have waited for the second lantern. I should have just fired it. No. What hit me? That stupid shot on the far right. The sky is Sinestra. Well, he is yellow. Well, he's gold, but gold is kind of yellow, so... Yes? No! I... What? Oh my god. I'm bad. I'm so bad. Let me tell you how bad I am. <clears throat> Not bad, man. That's... That's a good long stream there. That's a... That's a six-hour stream. Yeah, it's not bad, dude. It's not even that 14-hour stream I did of what, Rage? I did like 14 hours, that, or was it uh, Stick of Truth I did like 14 hours of in one day? Two 
too many attacks at too little time to charge. fire that what was i thinking oh I, i'm gonna hit him i'm just gonna keep him from doing it no god also by the way yes i have a new headset uh this is a hyperx cloud stinger i had to replace the uh razor kraken pro the uh cable was starting to short out and i was starting to lose hearing in both ears so That is a ridiculously tight window. <clears throat> Let me just turn my computer off. <laughs> End stream. I suddenly go offline and I'm never heard from again. I told you this would be the wall. <clears throat> RG500 HD. I'll have to remember that. I seem to go through a headset every eight months to a year, so... <clears throat> this is super lightweight, too. One of those that needs assembly? Can't say I'm aware of those. saw that coming I'm like no hmm I didn't know headsets came in a form that you had to assemble them I feel like I just want to blurt out headset friends assembled that's that may be highly inaccurate Blocked it except for the one shot that hit me. Somehow got lost. Oh, that sucks. <clears throat> a superhero fighting robot team with their robots combined into a headset. Seems legit. We will destroy people with the power of sound.
god, okay. No! No! Dang it! Fuck. Yes, Soundwave. It's now Soundwave from the Transformers. You heard it here. Soundwave is actually the combination of a super fighting robot that turns into a stereo. Or super fighting robots that turn into a stereo. Turn into a radio, actually. Stereo radio? The things you contemplate in this stream. <laughs> was a mini cassette, yeah, cassette player. That's what it was. I thought he was like a radio. But yeah, he is a cassette player because he shoots out Rumble, Frenzy, Ravage, Rat Bat, and I'm sure somebody else. I'm for uh, Laser Beak. That's who it was. I think it was Rat Bat. Too late. This is a Transformer stream. Well, kind of. I mean, it's giant robots. Two of them transform. Two of them transform to hideous monstrosities. That's not the right one. Nice. Good job. <laughs> What's Budgie Transformers? The ones you buy at the dollar store. Okay, sure. You know, the attack that I usually block is just like, Nope, I'm gonna sneak one through. <laughs> really edgy Transformers OC. Honestly, if I had the money and I ran a gaming company, I'd buy the rights to this game and turn it into a 3D fighter. Uh, or not 3D fighter, but like a 3D, uh, like mech sort of adventure kind of like um well that that's over i'm gonna get hit i can't stop that i'm not even gonna let myself get hit because i know it's gonna happen fuck it um but i would buy the rights to this game and make uh something similar to zone of the enders we'd st i'd start with the retelling of battle clash and the earth invasion and then I would do Metal Combat with the Earth Reinvasion. Actually, I take it back. Um, uh, the first one wasn't about an Earth Invasion. Why am I doing that? Wait for him to shoot. So, like, the first one, the Earth was already under control, so I'd start there. 
Oh, if I if I had the money and had a gaming company, I'd buy the rights to this game and turn it into like a Zone of Enders. Uh, I would restart with Battle Clash and do the telling of the story of the Earth already being taken over by Thanatos. And then it would progress from there and I would have the Earth invasion and all of that. And it'd probably make it into one game. Dude, I love Zone of the Enders, too. Seven fish and throwing them into the ocean. I don't know. I would have to decide what I was doing. I'd probably keep it true to the original two games at first. So, like... I think what I would do is I would have each area controlled by the chief, right? Like, so... New York, North America, all of that would be under the control of Guido with Garum. And he would have, like, a small army of different robots that would be controlling various cities, and once you started liberating cities, he'd take notice and he'd come after you. So, I think that's how I'd run the game. Not enough time he charges at so fast. I guess I've not really played Just Cause, but you'd uh, you'd be freeing all of the cities and stuff from their tyrannical rule in the name of the uh, battle game, which is what it would be called. That's what it's called in this game. Um, and I'd probably allow you to up like have custom upgrades and stuff like that. Like as you liberated cities and retrieved parts from different robots, it would unlock different. Uh, uh, different weapons and uh, armors and stuff like that you could upgrade into. Oh, I'm dead here. Yep, told you. So that's that's my idea. I would love to do that. And I'd make sure it was like a fully 3D thing. So like, you know, you're flying up and down and uh, you know, you've got bombs and, and laser guns and cannons and uh, missiles and probably a sword or something, I'm sure, like a laser sword. I'd have to change it a little bit, obviously. If I'm going to do 3D and you're going to have up-close combat, you're going to want a laser sword or something. Too late. And I'm sure I could arrange... Yeah, but I don't have a gaming company to do a Kickstarter with. I have no I have no coder. I have no 3D modelist. I only have concepts and designs in my head. <clears throat> and I would make sure it's playable on a controller this time, too. And I guess I'd opt for the ability to a person to be able to play it in uh, both first-person view or uh, third-person view. Well, I sealed my own fate there. I'd probably just call it Mantis Games. Or Manted Games or something like that. Mantis Entertainment. I don't know. I'd figure something out. <laughs> if you move it to an apartment, I don't think that's how that works. So what's it gonna do? Shit. Next mech game, Grind Fest. And I'm sure I would keep the, uh, the real mode you know, real mode, low, medium, and high difficulties as well. So, like, story mode would be the default difficulty, which would be, like, normal. 
and then real mode load kind of be like a normal plus and then medium would be medium and then high would just be high and it would be absolutely insane You fucking with me. I would love to do something like that in my lifetime, though. Sinestro Corpse Transformers Robot Game. But I think it'd be neat. I loved Zone of the Enders, and I'm sure I could work a nice, good story in as well. I got it. Oh, I blocked it. I fired too friggin' early. I'm, well, if you're going to make a game, you need it to be accessible. I'd probably have an easy mode. I mean, yes, I like difficulty, but I understand not everyone is as insane as I am. Nope. I knew it was Kevin. But I would want to try and stay true to the original material. Enigma Games, thank you so much for the host. But I would love to stay true to like the original material for the first game. And if it did popular or well enough, I would obviously figure out some way to expand the story past the story of Metal Combat. So... It's fucking 3 a.m. Why are you barking? Shut up. Hang on. No, my Twitch alert never tells me how many people host for. In fact, ever since I changed my chat over to be my bots chat, I don't even see how many people host for anymore. Unfortunately. This is my brother coming in. That's why the dogs are barking like mad. Move that. That's where I made some mashed potatoes earlier. Mashed the potatoes. Cook them, boil them, stick them in a stew, I think is how it goes. No, mash them, boil them, stick them in a stew. That's what it is. That is exactly what I was about to say. Mash them, boil them, put them in a stew. Um, I think I do. Rob some <clears throat> That's that new, you'll have to open it. That's uh, pink lemonade. I see that. I'll get some grape drink. Get some of that there grape drink. Oh, I'm going to regret these chips. <coughs> For those that remember my review on Ultimat. Oh, 
well, but they're so good. My brother found a bag, so I had to get them. They were good. Here is an A and W root beer. Mm -hmm. That's mine. Were those orange cream cakes any good? Yeah, there's one up there with your name on it. Oh God, really? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. I right, kick kick Thanatos' ass. He's kicking mine actually. So which challenge is this? No damage? Mm hmm. On real mode high. I and mean, I just took damage. Way to go. I'm so good, right? <clears throat> he practiced self love. So how was, uh. How was Morristown? Hmm? How was Morristown? Good. They tried to call a hooker at the event. Hmm. We gathered up 50 bucks. We were going to negotiate a price with the hooker. The guy that actually made the call, like, with his phone or whatever, he ran off. So, uh, woo! Oh, gosh. I've got napkins. Will you run around there and grab a napkin? Never mind. I got one right there. I didn't realize it was going to fizz on me. You were not getting... Instantly regret eating that. Some of them are so substantially hotter than others. Probably because they got more of that ghost powder on yeah. them. Oh my gosh. Oh. You'll like this. So they sell the... They sell Buffalo Wild Wings sauces at Walmart now. Seriously? Mm -hmm. So I could like literally go buy blazing sauce. I would make sure that my asshole turns into the outside rim of a volcano. I actually, I don't remember if they have blazing, blazing, but they have mango habanero. Oh my god, I love that mango habanero. It's so good, but it's so hot. I have, yes, it is, and I've been torturing myself. I bought a bottle, and oh I can't god. stop eating like, <clears throat> I can't stop eating chicken patties, like the microwave kind. The ones like, that I get. Yes, I can't stop eating those with some of that sauce on it. And I'm like, I know this is gonna hurt. I know I could make a home cooked delicious meal with this. But, but no, like, no, why? You just I just want to throw it on this microwave chicken patty and just call it a day. Come on, open. Well, congrats. Congrats, Enigma. <sighs> so anyway, what is the story of a hooker? So, I was asleep. I woke up. Saibi was using Artist Sage's phone. They were calling a hooker out of the back backlist or whatever it's called. They fucking they got this woman. They were looking for escort services first of all, and uh, oh my god! <laughs> so Artist Sage left, took the phone with the number on it with him. We never saw him. He never came back. So the fifty bucks that we scrounged up, I didn't put any money into it. I was asleep. I was opposed to the idea, but I kept quiet. <clears throat> we decided to go buy a bunch of pizzas instead. Huh. Which pizzas are more delicious than hookers? Yeah, probably. I didn't even know where my mouse cursor was and I fired to start the battle. I, I'm so great. I was just going to leave. Like, if the hooker showed up, I was going to be like, hey, I'm going to go get some food. I'll see y'all later. It was during Cyber's uh, X7 run. We were going to... Actually, we weren't even going to use her to, for her, her escorting services. We were going to actually pay her 50 bucks to play X7 with us <laughs> during a marathon. Apparently, Cyber was going to teach her how to play X7. I would say it's within the scope of their profession. Well, I mean... <laughs> they, get, they get paid to escort men and spend time with them, you know? It's true. You don't necessarily have to have sex with them. As long as they get their money at the end of the day, it's fine. Whew, man, my mouth is, feels like a stove. <laughs> Oh no, no, it's totally fine. I was expecting somebody to quote it. Mm. 
Nope, I'm done. That attack comes out so fast. <laughs> oh my god! Cyber shut the whole stream down at the end of it because we were we were fucking with her. And so we were just like, we got scoops. We got scoops. And she's like, I want to know. And then we refused to tell her. So she just shut the stream off in the middle of Ancient Aliens. <laughs> Which unfortunately kind of fucked up Private Cinnamon Bun's uh, computer. Because it, it was in coding when he, uh, we, he just turned it off. So... That one bomb, I was trying to get to it, and I couldn't get to it for some reason. That's tonight's new mood. I freaking love this game. This game is amazing. I was telling everybody in chat about my idea. If I had money in a gaming company, I would actually buy the rights to this game and make a re like do a remake. And make it kind of like Zone of the Enders. Um, but the first part's like you're liberating different cities of the different regions. And once you free them of like the boss rule or whatever, uh, then like the chief would show up and he'd be like, what are you doing? You know, you're undermining my, you know, my rule. You know, I was appointed by Thanatos. Or I was appointed by, An you know, Anubis to, you know, rule and, and answer to him. And so once you free, like, the original six, then you go on to battle the two, like, uh, Vi uh, Valius and Baron on the, the elevator and on the moon base, and then you take out Thanatos, and then you go back to Earth, and, you know, things aren't exactly what you seem, you know, so you've got, like, rebel, you know, like, rebel groups and stuff still trying to rebel. So that's when it would pick up with Metal Combat, put it all in one game. So it'd be, you know, like a retelling of the whole series. And I was thinking, like, you could have, like, upgrades, like, as you find, as you look around, you, you'd get upgrades, like, new laser cannons, or missiles, or a, even a laser sword, uh, long-range projectiles, speed boosters, you know, all sorts of stuff. And, uh, what I was thinking was, like, uh, you know, have the story and everything go with it, have the option to have first-person view mode or third-person view mode. Hmm. So... If you, you know, if you prefer that first-person view or whatever. I'll have to just move an apartment and, like, maybe clone myself so I have extra people. <clears throat> One thing I didn't like about Zone of the Enders is, like, if you were dashing and you did an attack, you did a dash attack. Oh, I'm done. It was you... either bomb or, or lose it. I'm still gonna lose it. Nice! Thanks, Thanatos. Rip run. Okay, now my nose my, my now my nose doesn't feel like a stove. Yeah, let's just go with that. It's like I have been making out with a wood stove. Or know, if I they're Mormon? What the hell, man? But yeah, if uh, if you made a game like that, so like while you're moving and you're dashing or whatever, instead of like coming to a complete halt and doing a dash type attack, to keep it more of like a, a tr to make it have that more feel like Metal Combat and stuff, to kind of keep that little bit of red <coughs> um, feel to it and make it and prevent it from just being like a melee type thing. While you're moving, you wouldn't stop. Like, you would still be firing regular projectiles. Yeah. Nope, 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 nope. I got him. I had to oh, waste two bombs, though, unfortunately. But okay. I, I progressed. It's all gonna come down to... Do I have enough bombs to destroy uh, Virvius when I get to him, pretty much? Virvius is going to destroy me, and you know it. Oh, God. Yes, because that fucker splits into three, remember?
Now here's where it's going to get hard. Every boss after this point is pretty much going to be a nightmare of some sort. This motherfucker. Just make sure you blow him in half. That'll make it really easy for you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, let me just blow him in half. Let's That's see how best. long that lasts. That's you have me best. curious now. You don't remember the attack he does? Oh, no, I do. Okay. I want to see how long it takes for him to destroy me after I do. Oh, never mind. He just destroys me in three seconds. Fun. Oh, my God. Her, her, Admiral, you're 12. Her, her. Wow. That's a spider, yes. Kill the fire. I have to burn all of Jupiter down. It has a massive spider infestation. Also, for the record, green shots are a little bit stronger than red shots. But they're, <sighs> but they're not as strong as purple shots. Oh my god, it's so hot. Like the blinking ones, yeah, they're definitely not. How spooters even live in Jupiter? Oh, I forgot about that. Now, let's see how long it takes him to destroy me. Yeah, you're fucked. Holy, Holy crap! What the... That was like three hits. That was like... Yeah! Like, what? That was it! My nose is running. <laughs> so I can tell you who you're definitely not going to call in this situation. I don't think it's going to be the Gustbusters this time. Uh, did it turn into an octopus? No. Um, I think you might call Terminex. Do they cover giant mechanical arachnids? Oh my god, how do you even stop that attack without blowing it up? Because, like, the littlest hit blows it up. See, this one, this is the one, it's like, oh yeah, shoot its weakness, please! Arachnus is definitely one of my favorite <clears throat> freaking... Um, one of the robots? Yeah, he's definitely one of my favorite SDs. Okay, that's how you do it. Okay, alright, we're getting it figured out here. I don't think insurance covers this. I have chips stuck down in that. miss okay whatever it's, it's easy you can't hit the broad side of a fucking barn so I'm actually further into this game than I was Battle Clash at this point in time I was on Schneider 
at the like six hour mark, right? That was around the time I beat Schneider. Around six, six and a half hours in, and he was the fifth boss. I'm on the sixth boss right now. That's one way to do it. But I don't have enough time. He just fires so much shit at one time. <clears throat> We're almost to two hours. I'm thinking about rethinking my life choices. Worst idea ever. Oh my gosh. I need water. Have at it. Wear it out. <gasps> I finished off the powder, the, the seasoning at the bottom of the bag. Oh my god. I'm trying not to cry. Didn't fire soon enough. Grandma begged me to let me try, have her try one, and she took a bite out of one, and she's like, nope. Like my mouth is on fire. And I was like, I asked her first. I was like, I'm telling you, these are hot. It's the hottest thing she'll ever have in her life. Is that chip? Probably. They are no fucking joke. Oh my god, why did I do that to myself? There's a video you need to watch at some point. It's <sighs> got uh, Neil deGrasse Tyson I mean, anything... talking about the secrets of the universe while eating hot wings. He goes all the way up to 500 and something Scovels. I, I mean, I know that. <clears throat> Anything that says that you it recommends gloves and goggles to eat is just don't eat it. Like in my experience, if you have to have gloves and goggles to handle something, it's probably acidic or, or an extremely powerful solvent. No! Oh it's God! Bomb. It's over. It's still a bomb. You'll live. I wonder if I can actually beat him still. He blocked it. The bomb? No, the shot. It hit him in the leg and I heard... Psh, not the damage noise, but the block noise. What? Is he immune to damage? When he's in that? Or maybe you just have to hit him in the eye. <clears throat> I told you you'd enjoy it. Transformers Devastation is the single best Transformers game ever made. Didn't realize, oh yeah, I forget that they made that game. Dude, Transformers Devastation is fucking great. Do you get to... <clears throat> is it giant mech fighting? Um, yes. You have... Five different Autobots. Optimus, I think Sideswipe, who a friend of mine nicknamed Booty Cruise. Uh, Bumblebee, I think Ratchet, and uh, Grimlock. And you can pick one of those five, and you have to go against the Decepticon forces. <laughs> Basically, imagine Bayonetta with Transformers. Me, Grimlock. Me, Grimlock, and no bows, oh, me, King. Who was Grimlock again? Grimlock was the Tyrannosaurus Rex. That's right. Me, Grimlock. Good, I oh stopped you. Oh my god, you. Good. <coughs> Oh, it was Wheeljack. Yeah, Wheeljack was in it. That's who. It wasn't Ratchet, it was Wheeljack, I think. I want to see Cup. Dude, Cup was great. Unless the dude in the new, unless the dude in the Michael Bay freaking Transformer series with the cigar in his mouth is supposed to be Cup. God! That's just so many shots. 
I'm not gonna lie, Michael Bay did completely fucking train wreck all of the Transformers stories. I won't even watch them. We don't speak that name here. I mean, storyline aside, they are good action flicks. But that is if you completely just say, you know what, to hell with all of the story that I know and love from my childhood. Okay, alright. Mmm. Oh, if you remember, if you blow No! Off, what hit me? If you blow off one of his lower legs, <clears throat> he can't do that stupid spider thing anymore. Uh, no, he can still do it. Oh, he can? Yeah, he just spins with three legs instead of four. Or six, or however many legs he's got. I only have, like... <laughs> Fucking space spider. Fired it too. I didn't fire it in the right position. It wasn't that I didn't fire it at the right time. I just didn't fire it in the right spot. Two hours and we're at Arachnus. I am making considerable time. But this is probably where the game is going to slow the fuck down. <clears throat> Metal Combat's gonna be like, fuck you, and it's gonna shoot you in the face with, with its energy legs. It'll be like, you're going too fast, and it'll tell you to slow down. Oh, he disappeared for a second. I thought you fucking blew him up. <laughs> it's like, oh god. That's so hard to stop. All of that constant barrage. Two hours, I still have no Oreos. Hey, Wolf, what's up, man? Oh my god, those are really good. <clears throat> How many have you had? Two? That was one. Oh, okay. I thought you ate two already. No. I was like, damn. You said I had one with my name on it. You're welcome so to I'm, another. No, I mean, don't tell me that. <laughs> don't tell me that. Do you want? Do you want any left for yourself? I mean, I can always buy more, but that's not the point. Oh God! Here we go. Nah, I got hit. The point is, is <coughs> for you to enjoy, not for me to. I wish Breath of the Wild looked interesting to me. And I, I hate that everybody, like, praises it as the best game ever made because it's clearly not. It's basically... Oh, the new Zelda game. Yeah. I mean, it's a good game. Don't get me wrong. I think it's an amazing game. Like, I think it's about time that Nintendo finally, you know, did something modern with the series. Oh. <clears throat> but at the enough. same time, like... At the same time, like... Oh, open, God! Open world... Open world platforms have been, like, yeah. kind of a big deal for, I don't know, since, what, like, I don't know, like, Mario fucking Sunshine? Oh, jeez. What the fuck just happened? I accidentally off-clicked the emulator and cost the whole attempt. I was like, it was right there on the edge and clicked off here. Oh, God. Way to go. <clears throat> that's such a, that's a... That is that is a straight noob thing. Is this your first day on Twitch? <coughs> what? That was a noob thing to do. Oh, I know, right? Off click, off click the emulator. That, like, that's what I'm saying. Oh wow! Four seconds. Okay, we lasted a while. <coughs> yeah, some bait to calm down the fire. I just put a new coil in mine this morning. I need to put a new coil in mine. Mine's built, not bought. Speaking of, I have something for you. I just need to find it. Oh, God! Ah! Bullet vomit! Rectal bullet vomit! <laughs> rectal bullet <clears throat> Why does it have to be rectal? Because it came out of his butt! Is that his butt? Are you sure? Yes, that's his butt. That is that is the butt of a spider right there. That is the ab... Or no, the thorax. This is the vape stream. Uh, get your cig grips and your uh, vape nations. Spin fidgets, get digits. Okay, we missed it. All right. Like, it wouldn't... 
he wouldn't be quite as difficult if he could keep on the same fucking trajectory. Yeah. <clears throat> this is what I mean. What? <laughs> <laughs> He's got a little cloud, and then that's uh, H3H3 with the Vape Nation thing. Have you seen that video? You need to go watch H3H3 do uh, Vape Nation. Will I get a boyfriend if I learn how to do spinner tricks? I don't know. <coughs> you yes. might get a uh, you might get a boyfriend, uh, but uh, he's probably gonna end up being trash. Actually, I don't know. you'll probably get a girlfriend because <coughs> that's I mean that's that's the thing is it's it's like dudes wearing rompers that vape, like and play with fidget spinners get all the bitches. Apparently. So they're fuck boys. Exactly. Women like fuck boys. Haven't wait, you don't know this? All the tens, if they are a ten Romp hymns are the dumbest thing. If they are a ten, they are gonna they're gonna walk into the bar, they're gonna look around, they're gonna find the biggest douchebag, and they're gonna say, you know what, I wanna go home and fornicate with that asshole. <laughs> Not the nice guy, no. Nope, wanna, that's it. I wanna find the biggest piece of garbage in this <laughs> I wanna find the biggest piece of That's how you find the biggest piece of garbage. Dude, I hate male rompers. They're awful. Like, who came up with that and thought it was a good idea? I don't know. Millennials? Fire <laughs> douchebag, who's talking shit about me? Nobody's talking about you, Quacken. Do you vape in a romper, Quacken? Because we're not. Because unless you do that, we're not talking shit about you. They this is this strong. is where the challenge ends, I bet. <clears throat> I have two, but I bought them because I'm a barely functioning piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> I you would never catch me in one. Yeah, me either. I mean, there are other douchebaggish things that you might catch me doing. <clears throat> like vaping or blasting Shit. freaking early 90s, late 80s rock music while I'm driving a fucking Jeep. <coughs> but, I mean... Oh, the spinners, not the rompers. Oh. I don't think I could own one. I would never get anything done because I know every time I've picked one up, I'm like, oh, this is pretty. Ooh, I just want to play with this forever. That's why they're so popular. Is they are. I mean, they are fun. They I well, I mean, they keep idle hands busy. Yeah. Right, here we go. I can't. Sorry. I have a friend who got a fidget butt plug and she uses it to cosplay as tails. I've I've seen that picture. Oh my! God. You get a fidget spinner, put it on a motor. Get two of those, like, foxtail butt plugs, and you have a fucking... You, and you can cosplay his tails properly. Or get a butt plug with two spinning tails on it. Oh, my God. <clears throat> <laughs> well, you can only cosplay his tails like that if you're willing to go bare-assed. Some people... I hate that picture. They keep idle hands busy. Isn't that what Herm and the One-Eyed Germans for? Oh my god! Herm and the One-Eyed German? I don't get it. Herm and the One-Eyed German. Now you get it. It took you a second. I was like, oh no. I need to put that on my stream too. I'm going to steal it from Enigma one day. Herm and the One-Eyed German. No, I'm going to steal that. Oh no. See, I've heard it called the other way, you know, freaking, you know. Okay, that got intense. When you've got needs, you know, you, you go find old uh, Handina and her five sisters. Fuck off, Arachnus. Rosie, Rosie Palms and her five sisters. <clears throat> yeah, Rosie Palmer and her five sisters. Oh, no. Don't fuck up. I got Superman. <clears throat> 
Oh, by the way, I brought you your little bottle back. Oh, did you? Nice. It's in my room somewhere. I'll have to get it out later. I'm probably like, <laughs> digging through my shit for it. <laughs> oh, that burp was hot. Oh, God. Ugh. Why do I punish myself like this? You've taken damage. Yeah, I know. I was just going. Rip, rip run. Accept defeat. <coughs> Please! Lord Pantyhose. <coughs> That's a great name, isn't it? That is a, a great name. Now you need a Lord Stalking. <laughs> the good thing about this fight is he does the same thing every time. Yeah, you kind of botched that a little bit. The bad thing is, is like, you can't do any fucking damage to him. Like, all the damage you've done to him has... You've literally just done nothing but defense. Yeah, that's all you get to do. I have a feeling this is going to be a very long fight. <clears throat> well, I mean, I beat Thanatos in a reasonable amount of time, but I had to waste two bombs. Well, you don't have two bombs. Oh, what happened to the timer? Hang on. <clears throat> it died. <coughs> <coughs> Rip time. Shit. It's too early. I'm getting the hang of him. I'm starting to figure it out. Salt is salty, and water is wet. I thought water was dry. And really <clears throat> no. And really Although, I have heard rumors that water likes to be around Chuck Norris. He doesn't go swimming. I can believe that. Particle man, particle man. Does whatever a particle can. I will check that in a little bit. Uh, quacking. The only damage you can do are little pot shots to do in his upper body and like secondary stuff of defense. Oh god! Oh god! Oh no! What? I opened him up! What does that mean? Look at his back! I don't... Oh god! No! Oh no. Ah, okay, at least he didn't get me with his ass. Huh. So what? what is that? I don't remember what happens when you blow off his ass. He starts spinning like a bastard! Well, when you blow, like, not when you just blow off the... No, open. but it means that the next shot, he doesn't have armor back there anymore. Ooh. Yeah! <clears throat> yeah, it's really hard to not blow off his lower half, or his upper half. <clears throat> you know, you should just aim for that little spinal piece right there. I feel like that's that's the best place. To All go. right, let's do this. You, you know, you see the the little the little piece of spine that holds the two halves together. That's definitely where you want to aim. Oh, obviously. <clears throat> Give me a second. This is gonna take a little bit. <coughs> so my question is. Well, you can't really blow up his lower half, can you? So that must be where the pilot is. Yeah, that's what I would think. Show and folder. Well, nobody would want to fly in a spider's ass. Sugar is sugary. Him and baseball! <laughs> Come on. Did I hear a Chuck Norris joke in 2017? By God, you did. 
You know what that means? We're in a fucking time machine. So much douchebag cloud. <coughs> So what do you want me to do with my empty bag of ass destruction chips? <laughs> ass destruction. Down here in the trash bag. Oh god, I didn't tell you this. So um, we had a big old shrimp boil at work. We boiled 40 pounds of shrimp. And if you've ever had a shrimp boil, if you've ever done a shrimp boil, you boil up a bunch of shrimp, a bunch of potatoes and corn and sausage, and it all goes to the big pot. It's kind of like a gumbo almost, you know? Um... We had, by the end of the day, we had like eight shrimp left over, eight ears of corn, and about nine potatoes. And these potatoes were the size of my damn fist. And somebody got the, somebody got the idea, they were like, Hey Elvis, why don't you go over there and uh, we will pay you a hundred dollars. We got the money right here. That's we all so pitch trash. in twenty. We got, <coughs> we'll have a hundred bucks for you. I want to see if you can eat all the rest of that food over there. So I ate eight ears of corn, eight freaking jumbo shrimp, and then I proceeded to eat seven fucking large potatoes. Let me see, where is it actually at? Did you hear me? I heard you. Eight ears of corn and seven <coughs> large potatoes. Seven large potatoes, damn. Twitch, stream sounds... Okay, I know where it's at. And I felt like a giant potato after that. As a matter of fact, I, I'm surprised that I'm not sprouting potatoes out of parts of my body. Okay, now... What are you doing? Adding a new voice sound. Thanks, Quacken. I'll steal it from Enigma and you, then. The clock is ticking. It's fine. Let it tick. Alright, let's test this thing out. What is it? Uh, come on. Edit. It's a butt. Why is it not playing? <clears throat> did you get new headphones? Yes. I thought you did. Those look, those look different. Let's just make sure it actually has sound to it. Oh no. Well, it has sound to it. Oh, I bet I know what's going on. I'm dumb. I muted my stupid bot. Keybot. None of them are working. What's going on? Tell you what. Give me a second. It's Ankbot. And everything crashes. Yep. That's probably a... That right there probably just broke stream. What do you mean broke stream? Ebrick2! Thank you so much for the follow. You're now an honorary mantoid in the fight against evil. Thank you.
Nobody knows Particle Man. That's a good song. Yeah, it just popped into my head pretty randomly. They might be giants. They might. They be. might not be, they but might. they might be giants. Yeah, that's very true. There's a 50-50 chance that they're giants. <clears throat> I think we can all agree on that. Now, let's see if this works. Oh, no. There we go. I know there's more of you in there. Oh, no. Oh, it works. What is it? Oh, no. It's Knuckles going, oh, no. So. Let me check the cooldown on it real quick. Uh, I gotta... Actually, it's not really so much a funny story. It's more of a sad story, actually. So Friday night after work. Yeah. Oh God! Here goes the sound spam. I like how he's just like Friday night after work, and he just leaves. So let me guess. All everybody's spamming. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! no oh no! Um. They were spamming all of them. Uh, that one did not play. It's, I'll play it for you. It's a butt. What it's all your sounds do you have? You have the cat. I have Tango from Mega Man. I have Velgarder from Mega Man X. Yeah. I have, I have Ruby saying it's a butt. Yeah, and and then I've got Knuckles saying, oh no. And that's it. I want to get a uh, bark from Rush and add it on there at some point. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I know why you didn't get butt to work, because you're on a cooldown. Everybody has an individual cooldown, as well as the sound itself having a cooldown. <clears throat> I don't have enigmas, please. For some reason I thought you took damage already, but you didn't. Good job. It's a butt. Yep, there it went. There it goes. I sure blow off some arms. Blow off some legs. Just don't blow his ass off. Fucking rectal bullet vomit. <laughs> I wish there was a way to stop him from doing that. Oh my god! The one shot I didn't take! Fuck. Fucking rectal bullet vomit. Yeah, I don't have ranks for Zokrin yet. I'll eventually get them. Oh yeah, so anyway. <clears throat> went to a bar Friday. I went to an extremely fucking redneck. I went to a biker bar. Oh, God. Oh, no. Biker bar? Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah. And it was karaoke night. I fucked up some Alan Jackson real bad. Oh, no. Oh, God. It was bad. Oh, no. But actually, it was really funny. I actually I had a good time because everybody there was actually really chill. And everybody was actually like a bunch of... Really cool guys, actually. Nobody was like a big fucking asshole or anything like that. But I spent pretty much all of Saturday in the fetal position. Why? Because I was so fucking hungover. Oh god. Because I, I tried to finish off this bottle of... This two liter bottle of vodka that I just polished off. I tried to finish that off Saturday, and I just didn't quite make it. And I, I ran out of Mio, so I, and I, or, so I didn't have anything to mix with it in my fridge or in my house. So I was like, well, I'm going to go down to the bar. Walk okay. In, spend an hour, fucked up Alan Jackson on karaoke, had three beers. Oh, got a triple! And, yeah. But it was sad, because... There's been very, very few times in my life where I've ever gotten so drunk that I could not walk. 
and I swear to god, I thought I was gonna have to crawl back to my apartment. <laughs> oh, you're gonna kick his- oh, you're- oh, don't, don't fuck up. Don't fuck up. Shh. Got him! Yes! Hell yeah. Nice shoot. Woo! Nice fucking shoot. Nice! I was not expecting to get him for a while. Yeah, I grinded that one out. That one actually didn't take as long as I thought it was going to. I'm doing really well for this challenge. Only two and a half hours in, and I'm coming up on Cobra. Cobra. Oh God. For some reason, I don't remember him being that that bad, though. Have you seen him on Real Mode High? No. Didn't he gold plated? Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, like everybody after Saturn's gold plated, aren't they? No, everybody's gold plated. <clears throat> Even Saiyang was fucking gold plated. He had some silver, but save at nine. All right, here's my grave. Rip run. I got to learn the shot rhythm all over again. Oh yeah, and he absorbs energy and shit. What the fuck? Yeah, that. That. He absorbs your uh, oh, your no. shots and then returns them back at you. So he has like these massive fucking like fully charged bullet sprays out of nowhere. Oh god, if you hit him with a triple, you're done. Yeah, no, you don't get a triple because he sucks the energy charged out of you for your shot. What? Yes. I don't know how to stop that. See, that's the problem. I don't know how to stop that. Oh god, I forgot about that completely. I just feel like I had more, I always felt like I struggled more with coat or uh, what's, the, I always felt like I struggled more with arachnid than. I, on normal, I have his rhythm down pretty well. This is where the run ends, guys. Yeah, because. If he fires those green shots and then immediately absorbs energy, all my little bullets get spiraled into his shield until those green shots are point blank. So I he basically cannot machine gun fire. One shot! You gotta hit that shield. How in the fuck did you just do that? You hit that diamond. What the fuck? What the fuck? You gotta, you, dude, you gotta fucking take that gun. Out. I know! That thing is dangerous. But he won't hold still long enough for you to target it. Shit! He is so fast on that, too! Yes, like, that is. is a screen cover! Yes, it is. I can't believe it. I, I don't know what I hit on that shield. You but hit it took it out. In the very Was it, is that what I hit? I don't know. Sure. It took it out in one shot, though. How powerful was that shot? Just normal. But you have to be dead on that fucking shot. God, this is going to be ridiculous. See, I feel like those flashing shots would do way more damage than that. <laughs> this is, there's so much going on. Is this what it's like to do drugs? <laughs> I knew Cobra was going to give me problems. I was not expecting to get a super lucky shot like that, though. Oh, wow. You 
watched his freaking absorption. Okay, I know what I need to do now. Every time I get one lantern, fire it at him. Because then he can't retaliate with green shots. That's the strategy. Future is literally going to have to whittle him the fuck down. Mm hmm. He's super fucking big, too. So. Well, from this point out, they're pretty much all giant fucking screen covers, so. Really? A purple shot. A fucking purple shot. Oh, uh, one time I shot a neutron beam right as he freaking did that. <laughs> Don't do drugs, kids, or you'll get attacked by this huge fucking robot. What the fuck? <laughs> Did you hear me, dude? What? I shot a neutron beam at him right as he, right as soon like I fired it, and then he was like, "Oh, by the way, I'm just gonna fucking absorb this neutron beam." And oh, if no. you remember, the neutron beam wipes like three quarters of your fucking health. <laughs> I was like, "You motherfucker!" <laughs> and he shot it right back at me, and it was just a, it was a wipe. It's just there like, was, nah, you're done. No, you're done, so kid. Do. There was nothing I could do. It was pathetic. Got him. I got the shield! What'd you hit, the diamond? <clears throat> Shoot the gun! Losing that shield really messes with him. Cause not only is that shield like impervious to everything, it also absorbs stuff. Got the gun! Half of it anyway. Well, that's the most dangerous. Oh, holy crap. I forgot that he can still use it. Got it. Gun's gone. Well, this run is going to be complete. No, it's not over yet. What, what else can he do other than shoot little fucking green spots? Oh, you're you're gonna be you're gonna be surprised if, if I, I don't remember him having shit. I need to play defensively. Yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah, but that exposes his weakness, though. Yeah, you were fucking him up right now. I feel like I'd be a little bit more scared of Groken. I used to have a lot of problems with Groken. Just because she reflects everything? Yes. She's broken as fuck. Groken the broken. Some of these shots are getting so damn close. Here we go. That was not as hard as I think you thought it was. That was intense, though. Yes, it I was. was like, like I could, I felt like I couldn't blink. Like I had to keep my eyes open, bleeding with attention. I believe it. Oh my god. I can't believe I got past that. I almost loaded by accident. Would have had to fight him again. Don't do that. I'm surprised that went as smooth as it did. That went very smooth. That was, a, <clears throat> that was incredibly lucky. He was one of the ones I was actually truly feared. Oh god. Groken the broken. Groken the broken. The only thing that hurts is blinking spots. Also, Groken likes to fill the stupid screen with a billion shots. Yeah, that's that's why I had problems with her, is because you I just couldn't defend against everything and I couldn't do damage fast enough. <clears throat> this will be a long fight. Luckily though, she doesn't Oh my gosh. See, they just... In Look at how slow these bullets are going! Because everything's lagging. Oh, God, I forgot. Like, even if you just miss barely on that freaking... On those arms. By the way, I just would like to point out we are in the methane sea of uh, Uranus. So why isn't the whole fucking thing exploding right now? Because methane is highly explosive. 
Oh god. Okay, one arm down. Two arms down. All right. Oh god. Bullets, bullets, bullet, 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 bullet. No, I wasn't paying attention. <sighs> if you had loaded instead of saved, I would have cried. I would have cried too. I'd have just been like, <laughs> "Don't do drugs, kid. This red giant robot will fuck you up." <laughs> it's not exploding because uh, fuck you. <laughs> hey, makes sense. I thought it was not exploding because of Hey, Ebrick 2! Because we don't obey physics in video games. We make our own physics. I can't believe it's 4 in the morning. I really want to watch you beat this, beat this, though. Oh, just at least get past Groken? I feel like after Groken, it'd be pretty smooth sailing. Virvius! Oh god, Virvius. I forgot about fucking Virvius. Oh, he's gonna push your fucking shit in. Yep, he's gonna bend me over like a fucking five dollar whore. Oh my gosh, cause he makes Thanatos look like a freaking pansy. That's one down. Basically, Groken is the equivalent of bullet hell in this game. Bullet hell. I mean, Groken is absolutely massive, which there's that benefit, Something like 40 meters in length? It's like 120 feet long. It's like the size of a freaking airplane. Okay. Alright. Gotta keep my eyes peeled. I like how you're just machine gun. Holy crap. There's just too many freaking bullets! What the heck? By the way, uh, orbiting Jupiter is where you fight Arachnus, and then the Epsilon ring of Saturn is where you fight Cobra, yeah, and then that. the Methane Sea of Uranus. Hey, welcome to Toho, guys. I didn't realize it's playing Toho. Hey, you know what I just realized? We should just start importing all of our natural gas from Methane or from Uranus. We would never run out. Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! That's uh, that's scary. Isn't Neptune pretty much just nothing? Uh, all methane? of the outer planets are just pretty much methane. Well, I didn't think Jupiter was. No, Ju they all are. Um, they are all really high uh, methane uh, content. Hmm. Curious. Well, I see how our future generations will get fuel. We are gonna burn. Got it! Once they're done burning all the fuel on this planet, they're gonna be like, we're gonna burn fuel from other planets. Okay. Got it! Okay, we're actually making good progress here. Oh, God. Stop juggling your own shot now. With American types of cars, you're just just support your needs for like five years. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it, Bolasov. By the way, don't say nothing, but check this out. That was a while back, but still. Oh man, first shot! There you go.
Okay. You were like, nope, nope, and nope. Nah, too many shots on screen. You're, I wasn't able to clear them out. You're gonna have to use a chart, a lantern shot. I'm. S uh, you see, I'm trying to not bomb. I know. I need bombs for Virvius. I know you need bombs for Virvius. And then I need bombs for Gigadisp. I gotta take those eyes out. Oh, that's right. Well, you'll have one bomb for her. And there's no point in using a using a bomb against the second Gigadisp. Are nope. you gonna? Tr are you gonna? I'm going to go for the good ending. Okay. Not the sad ending. Right. I'm going to go for the one where Mike and uh, Rola are both alive. So that's going to be stressful as hell. What? I'm pretty sure I fired bullets at that thing. Whatever. Obviously not. Well, the game doesn't think you did. It says, Psh, you didn't shoot at me. I'm getting better at that first shot, though. That's gonna be the goal right there, is just get those arms out of the way early. I'm getting the worm out too. The one that comes through the where the arms used to be. Yeah, you're gonna the only problem is you're gonna have to figure out a strategy for that I game. shouldn't have risked that. Oh well. You're gonna have to figure out a strategy this for is when actually she filling the So screen. far this has been way easier than Battle Clash was. Yeah, I've noticed that. I wonder This may actually be a one stream challenge. It'd be the first one. I think I think it might have to do with the fact that in Metal Combat you had that uh, different charging system too. That a is a possibility. Bit, you got a little bit more control over the power of your shots. You yeah, know, that is true. Also, um, enemies were way more reasonable on the harder difficulties. Like, you can actually, well, you can speedrun both games on the hardest difficulty. I've got 30 minutes on Battle Clash on Real Mode High. By the way, speaking of, did you hear I got 27 seconds on Ivan? The How? big giant crawling turtle? How? Optimal strats. I figured out how to take his entire... I figured out how to basically kill him without destroying his... Um, his whole body. Like the whole upper thing where he's got the four plates that move or whatever. Yeah. That are impervious to... Yeah, I figured out how to take those out and kill him in one go. So you basically get, like, two charges and he's done, pretty much. Oh, shit! I got hit. I missed that shot. Um, you basically, you fire into the shutter, pop it open, fire a shot. You do that t twice per cannon. Then you throw the bomb, and it takes out, if you throw it dead center... It takes out all four cannons, dealing double damage to all the cannons, which is too much for <clears throat> Ivan to handle, and it just straight kills him. Hmm. You still win by turning it off. No. We're going in. Jam monster? Yep, I bought some jam monster. <laughs> they didn't have the blueberry in three milligrams, so... I bought it and I bought the strawberry in three mil instead. In the words of Vegeta, where do all these shots go? I don't remember Vegeta saying that. Was it Vegeta in uh, DBZ Abridged? I don't remember. Or was it Goku? It might have been Goku. I know uh, Goku had something about a muffin button. It was, a, it was somebody in DBZ Abridged was like, I wonder where all these shots go, and then it showed a plane and it just get fucked Oh, yeah. Out. I, I, yeah, somebody said that. I don't remember who, though. Okay, I got that one. Mm -hmm. Oh, God! You actually survived. 
I don't want to charge my shot unless that uh, worm comes through. Yeah, because it, it's just going to reflect back at you anyway. Like that. Exhibit A. Luckily, it's not full strength. Nope, I'm done. I hate to say it's it. It's TN. He thinks it was TN. Tank does. Where do all those shots go? You know, I think you might have to bite the bullet and then use the bomb when that happens. I Does the really... bomb do any damage to her? No. Oh, that's terrifying. It just clears shots. That's all it does. So it doesn't matter if I use a bomb or not. It does no damage. It's just... It's just a screen clear is all it is. Because <clears throat> I remember... Virvius was my strategy with him was I would just walk in with five bombs. That's the strategy I'm going with. Nice! Because that's that's like really the best strategy for Virvius. And that's think, the one I'm going with! And I think that was the one that you gave me was just go in with five bombs and it makes him so much easier. Cause you couldn't take bombs, like if you didn't use a bomb, you couldn't take it with you to the next match, right? No, you can take bombs. Well, not in the... Not in Battle Clash, but you can in uh, Metal Combat. That's why I'm trying to stock five bombs. That's why I'm trying to not bomb Groken. Even if it's to screen clear, I need all five bombs for both Virvius and Gigadesp. You're gonna have you're gonna have to do a charge shot for that when she spams the screen like that. And then just deal with the charge shot reflecting back at you. Like, I really don't see any other way. But I don't have enough time to charge! Too. Got the worm. Got the other worm. The ten the tendrils will come out now. Nice shooting. Do damage quickly. Oh god. Yeah, I forgot about that. I did too. Alright. Wrecker shit. I'd say they'd probably kill her. <gasps> oh no. Oh, you're fucked. No, I'm not. <sighs> Stop shooting in her armor. She's only got that thing open for a brief second. You can hit the wiring. The open spots there where the arms were. No, I want the... I want her face, honestly. It's about to cost me the damn attempt, though. Oh, you want to blow the whole damn thing up. Oh, that's right, because a lot of people haven't seen that. Oh, God! Alright, I kind of... I'm, I'm agreeing with you. Okay. Well, there, there, there it is. is! You get to see it, kind of. Whew! Tank says, hey, Brotoma. What's up? Brotoid the coach. Unusual magnetic field detected. Dropping out of hyperspace. I'm not ready for this. Dun, dun, I'm not ready for dun, this. Dun, 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 dun. That fucking ominous music that you know you're about to get your shit pushed in. This Raz Grizz squadron when do you need him? So far, the one that's taken the most time, I would say, has been Thanatos. Thanatos or Arachnus. 
Yeah, and I would believe that. I am. Because of I am honestly is, surprised. I'm this far in. I would. I could believe that because Thanatos, it, it's his basic design. Like he's going to. He's. And this is gonna suck. I'm gonna try without bombs and see how far I get. Cause you're leading for the second form. Oh, it ain't even the second form I'm worried about. What are you worried about then? This one. This one's way harder than the second form. I think. Really? Yes. You can't bomb spam the second form. Yeah, this far. Because we've done Garam, Siamang, Wong, Griffin, Viscount, Thanatos. That's six. Then we get to the uh, elites, which are Arachnus, Cobra, and Groken. So that's nine. Virvius is ten. Transformation's 11. Gigadesp is 12. We're over halfway done. We're actually two-thirds done at less than three hours. This is still a challenge. This is still harder than the Zelda challenge. I don't oh, want to have to resort to bombs. I forgot about that attack. Yes, that attack. He's just like, nope, instant. And it's Throw a, everything. It's a fucking screen cover. Yes, it's a screen cover. And you're moving everywhere. Both up, down, left, right, diagonal, front, back, behind, upside down. I mean, you name it. You're moving everywhere. You dick! Oh yeah, and I forgot that he also multiplies. Rip. Damn, it's critical. Dun 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 dun. So who does he have to fix his shit when he's this far out in space? Who? Oh, Mike. Mhm. Mm I guess him. Him and you, because remember, it's an ST where the pilot and the gunner aren't the same. Yeah, and everybody's like... <laughs> Looking at him multiply really makes me feel like I'm having some sort of trip. Yeah. And it's hard to figure out which one it is. Oh, which one's the real one? Yeah. I don't even know how to approach him. Like, I don't know how to approach him. Uh, Tank says he made a car he thinks you'll like. He made a car? What's in yours? Superman! I like. It's uh, vanilla sherbet, isn't it? I don't know. It's Superman. Whatever, whatever flavor Superman ice cream is. It's vanilla sherbet. Didn't it have other flavors on it, too? No, it was it was one flavor, but it was three colors. Hmm. It was the red, blue, and white, I think. Or no, it was like red, blue, and something else. Red, blue, and yellow. Was it yellow? Yeah, it was. Let's see, look at Super Red. I colors. rather affectionately call it shit car in B S C, B and W style execu uh, executive car with a big ass turbo, fat tires, and is really hard to drive. In beam in beam ng drive is the name of it. Beam NG. Beam NG. I think that's the name of the game. He calls it the shit car. <laughs> the shit uh, car. Cal wants to know when you're coming to hang out again. Cal? Yeah. I, I don't know? Question mark? God! Yeah, that was a one hit fucking kill. <laughs> I remember that, that attack wrecking your shit. Yeah. Being an instant kill. I remember it not being an instant <laughs> kill, but I remember it being extremely devastating. Cal says, dude, did you not realize it was me this whole time? Cal. Over at Karen's? Oh. I don't think he did, Cal. 
No, I didn't. What the fuck just happened? I got one shot, I essentially. I was thinking, when I heard Cal, I was thinking, like, a dude named Cal. And I was like, I haven't talked to a oh, dude named no. Cal since high school. God, this hurts. I'm actually curious if the blur... Come over here and tell me when he blurs if it actually shows up on my thing. Because the mic's in the way, oh, I know, you from your I angle. Have do, I have to do shit? I want to see if it's actually showing with Fuck. the blur. Oh, I know. I don't want to fucking do shit. I want to be lazy. Haha, uh -huh, you hit him in the arm and it fucked his, it fucked his football game up. You know you took damage, right? Yeah, I know. Never mind. <laughs> you died anyway. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I fucked your mother. <laughs> I want to get that laugh and add it as a sound clip, but I don't know how to s how to isolate uh, sound in this. Do you have a sound editor on your computer? But I don't know how I would be able to do it anyway. Well, you would All right, to... let's actually see him blur. Oh, you used the bomb. Oh, just I did. Survive. Okay. Um. They. I mean, it just looked. They're... Yeah, they're actually showing the blurs. I like it. Dude, he's fucking wrecking you. See, right? that's the difference in 30 FPS and 60 FPS. Some people stream at 30, and in 30, only one of them shows when he blurs. When he splits, like, it'll show one, and then it'll show the other, and then it'll show the other. Like, they kind of fluctuate. It's not, you see both of them simultaneous. Alright, let's actually see if I can kill this motherfucker. Let's play some Tetris, motherfucker. Nope, never mind. That one green shot. Go back to your green country. Rednecks might be like, well, shit. But sophisticated people will be like, that is some fine manure, good sir. Hmm. God, the quotes, man. My quotes are great. I love my quotes. Well, you know what? I'm sure your quotes love you, too. Never mind, I got hit. I'm gonna try and, like, I genuinely can't watch this fight. The flashing's too much, hit my eyes. Epileptic seizure! It's okay, have a puppy. Puppy! I have a pug emote on my channel. Pug. Alt Puggo. I got fucking hit. Are you serious? It just takes so long for the bomb to get out there is the problem. My job to defend myself while it's in route. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I really don't think that I could have ever beat this game as a kid if I didn't stockpile five bombs for Virvius. Yeah, I mean, well, Virvius is probably the hardest fight in this game. To be fair. The hardest non-gimmick fight in this game. There are no gimmicks to this fight. Giga Desp is a gimmick fight. This is the single hardest non-gimmick fight in this game. He is just straight up raw difficulty. I thought you blew an arm off for a second. I'd be like, it's a little early for that now, isn't it?
I like how he covers himself. He's like, defend! Nice! nice! And you are now bombless, sir. Oh my god, are you serious? Five bombs! And he did not die. He was so close! Guys! Guys! Three hours! It's like rolling over a odometer to a hundred thousand miles, man. It should be celebrated. Hit bruh. Holy crap. He's I'm turning directions! I'm basically just trying to interrupt any time he... in this void of gaming. This is the fire blue of this game. Man, what are you gonna do about the second form? I don't know. You're just gonna have to... I don't know! As fast as possible. I don't know what I'm gonna do about the second form! Are you kidding me? You're literally just gonna have to... just... blow the fuck out of every one of those mouths. I forgot how little the bombs actually do in damage. Yeah, in Battle Clash they do way more because of that bug if you know when to fire him. He gonna just die, I guess. Yes, there is a second form to this thing, MTX. And it's not over. The second form might actually be harder. We'll find out. I don't remember how he is in uh, real mode high. Ridiculous. Yeah, but he's also huge, which makes him an easy target. Whereas the problem with Virvius is that he does this kind of crap, and he's a small target. One good thing about bombs, though, is it allows you to charge your lantern while still doing damage. Mm-hmm. Which is great if they have a vulnerable area open... Because then you can charge Lantern and you can ma deal some massive damage to follow it. That fucking... His green shots feel like they're stronger than um, some of the others. I think they are, honestly. Because he's got what... How many purple shots hit you when he does that thing where he charges his horns and everything? I don't know. Like four? Even with five bombs, this is still hard. Like, I'm actually trying now. Like, the first couple tries, I just wanted to see... Jesse Kid! Hey, what's up? How are you doing? Surprised to see you in here. You doing okay? Nope. Tank says he's been coming up with some fictional aircraft for universities riding called Shattered Skies. Wait, he's been. I'm up okay. Before? I'm somehow have not lost my sanity from this challenge yet. Coming up with some fictional aircraft. Well, the Ace Combat was either four or five was called Shattered Skies. It might be what he's basing it yeah, on. Yeah, I was gonna ask if he was kind of basing it off of that kind of that kind of concept. 
Yeah, it's. I mean, I'm when I am streaming. I mean, there is. It's a good chance I'm streaming around this hour. But I'm super glad to see you. I'm glad everything's going okay for you. I don't know what to do about those stupid green shots. Because they come in with the bombs, so... You take them. You take them to the face like a porn star. <clears throat> and you shout money shot. God, I can't say things like that. There's, there's young gears in here. Well, I mean, it's kind of expected for awful language to be in this stream. I mean... It's the internet! There's garbage in there! <laughs> it's, it's not a big truck! It's a, it's a series of tobes! <laughs> what? You need to look that up. Some politician was trying to explain the internet. It's not a big It's not truck. a big truck. It's a series of tubes. Alrighty then. You say so, Mr. Fucking Politician. That makes way too much. Did you take damage? No. Damn, Damn. you stupid! I feel like Virvius is just in there like, It's more along the lines man. of Waterworld. There's very little land He's left. Just... An asteroid illegally parked on Earth and shenanigans, except instead of Kevin Costner, there's spider jets. This is how Virvius fucking drives. I'm gonna just fly all over the fucking place right it's, now. He's just like, oh, nope, nope, I'm over here, nope, yep. I'm over oh, here. I'm nope, gonna I'm go here. this way, now I'm gonna go that he way. He needs driving lessons. <laughs> Maybe he's drunk off his ass. If I was an drunk evil, on four locos? Yeah, if I was, if, I mean, if I was an evil intergalactic warlord, I mean, I'd probably be drunk off my ass, too. Okay. Holy crap, how did I miss you? I'm thankful that it did. Took a hand. Oh, hello. No! Wait, what the fuck? Oh, it The missed. bomb totally missed! Holy crap, that's... Oh. Aircraft I've created are the XF-14G Bobcat and the XRA-117B Ghost Hawk. The former is a variant of the F-14 Tomcat and the other is an experimental reconnaissance version of the F-117 Nighthawk. Hmm. Interesting concept. You know, if I really thought, I, ne I never really thought about trying to use an F-117 in a reconnaissance mission, but I mean, it makes sense, really. Although now that there are better, much, 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 much fucking better. That's that's a road. dice roll if I've ever seen it. Dodging that. This game is amazing. I, this is one of my favorite SNES games. You need a super scope for it, and like to play it on a console. Uh, but it's definitely worth playing. Um, oh, I'm just doing an so absolutely fun. insane challenge on the hardest difficulty where I can't get hit. And I'm slowly having regrets because this boss is legitimate, unbridled difficult. Because he just fills the damn screen. Like. All the time. Yeah. And in uh, the hardest difficulty, every single every single boss is gold colored. It's because they're ballin'. They're such freaking badass intergalactic warlords that they're freaking, they got all that money. They got all that gold plating. Why'd I throw the bomb then? I don't know. What am I thinking? Like, I ha I'm waiting for him to split, so then I throw it. Instead, no, I'm just gonna let the green bullet hit me. Why not? I mean, pfft. Don't you get a bomb between various 1 and 2? I don't remember. I think you do. But it doesn't really help much, because I'll have, like, one bomb. That is true. I either get that shot or I don't. Fortunately, though, emulation allows me to play this with a mouse, so I can still play it kind of the way it was intended, but not really. 
If I had a way to do a capture card and I still had my sensor, if I could find it, uh, I would definitely do this on a console. It's in the shed somewhere. Actually, I think I'm pretty sure I could find your sensor. The only problem would be... Finding... Is there... Well, your super sale's behind me here. Yeah, I know that. I know where that's at. Then it would just be finding the, S the NES itself. Oh, you hit one of them damn things. You! Oh my god, I don't have words for him. He is a hippopotamus butt leech. Hippopotamus butt leech? Yes. Okay, there you go. Somebody better quote that. Plot twist, Vermius is secretly piloted by Doom Guy. That's why he strafes so much. Okay, it was enough to keep him from doing it. I ruined it. Ruined it! He's running out of limbs to blow up, finally. Excuse me, sir. Please stop hitting me. <laughs> I actually had somebody in here that was being all like, yeah, that's rude. He's shooting at you. I was like... <laughs> He's a hippopotamus butt leech. Yes. It has been added as a quote. Thanks, Tank. I'm not gonna lie, that that I stole that off my Facebook this morning. Oh good, I got it. You shot me in the fucking fist! You! Oh my god! Turd burglar. <laughs> what the hell, Quacken? A button boobs. I'm interested, yes. A butt and boobs. It's a butt. It's a butt? It's a butt. It's a butt. <laughs> Tooters! These emotes, though. <coughs> this is like so unsafe. Someone should call the police. Yeah, this is. I knew this guy would be a problem. Breath of the Wild button boobs. Oh, he didn't get to see the arachnid fight earlier. How can I make this believable despite being impossible in the world? That's a good thing to do, though. You've got to have a sense of, like, belief. I fired it too late. Pretty much any time he throws bombs or splits is when I'm bombing. Because it'll cancel them out. There's just too many bombs on screen to freaking... I hate it when he splits into three because you have an actual potential to miss a bomb entirely. And you're if you don't bomb him, you're going to get hit. His def 
defense is really high. Yes, and you stunned him. <laughs> God, that was close. That is such a dice roll, though. What? What just hit you? Oh, he threw his fist at you. No! Even before that, no, he did the overhand smash attack. And because he was up, it came down. I had no way of dodging it or blocking it or nothing. Well, he decided to throw all of his. He's like, hands nah, at I'm gonna end it. Bah! He's like, here, have a punch. Here, have another punch. Have a kick. Have another kick. Now I'm a quadriplegic. All right, you go get some breakfast. Uh, have a good day, Jess. It's good to see you in here for a change. I'm always in your stream. <laughs> But yeah, go get some breakfast and you have a good day, okay? Gorsh, Dodge, why you no work? Is that goofy? That's fucking goofy. So is Minnie Mouse. That's why uh, Mickey divorced him. Or divorced her. Whatever. What about Minnie Mouse? I was totally not paying attention to where the cursor was, and I'm like moving all around trying to find it. I have been streaming a bit more lately, Jess. Minnie wants the goofy D. <laughs> Minnie wants the goofy Nice. That sucks. I didn't fire it soon enough, and he even he even moved so that the bombs just went up and out of I the. I know, I saw that. I was God. like, what? It's just the drugs talking. One of the things about Virmius and those bombs, though, is even when he splits into three because of his drunk fucking driving. Hang on. Oh my god! Holy crap. Incoming! No! That's the sound of true anguish. Those limbs are very hard to dodge. Or to destroy. Hey, Psychic Mario! You twat. Can't he charge those up, too? The small he, green ones? No, when he throws his limbs? Yeah, no, he doesn't. He can't charge them up. I thought he could. No. Meanwhile, it's 4.10 a.m. and I'm watching a stream. Meanwhile, it's 5.09 a.m. and I'm hosting a stream. Oh, wait. Having a stream, rather. Oh god, please don't tell me it's 5 in the morning. Yes, it is. Holy crap. I've been... A, I've been... A, I have officially been irresponsible. That 
That was a dice roll. He's gonna bomb again. Good call. Dead center of mass! Dude, that did a lot of damage, actually. It's because I let my guard down. I don't know what I was thinking. Welcome to the doll <laughs> where you make lots of bad decisions. I'm pretty good at that. You got so fucking lucky on that shot. Yes, I did. No! Damn, no! 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 That's fucking. That's crushing. No! That's fucking crushing. No! <laughs> oh my god, no! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> and chat goes crazy. Oh, it was so close. All the crying lost souls. Uh, I have to do this all over again. Well, you got a good strat down. Yeah, it's just... I'm waiting. That's always a dice roll because of how it moves everywhere. I can't believe it just oh, it's so crushing. Now I thought you were telling me I need to stream on like a console wolf and I'm like, I don't have a, a video card right now. I have plans to eventually get one. Rip run. But I know if I wanted to play this, I'd have to completely rearrange this room. I'd have to move this TV over here. Could be done. Good bomb. I don't know when to fire to dodge those. Svelte. <laughs> uh, 
Yeah, I have a fat boy PS2. <laughs> Everyone is suddenly so angry because Virvius beat me by blowing up. He beat you by blowing up. And now for my ultimate attack. Well, that's one way to do it. Really? Actually, that's that's a good strategy. What? Wait for the three, the three lantern, and then hit him with it, and keep him from uh, splitting. Cause it's about the same time. Cause he always starts with bombs, so it gives me time to get that third lantern. Actually, I think we'll start doing that from now on. As you go more offensive, though, it lowers your defense. Oh, you're talking about just for the first. Yeah, and you get that initial free kill. How did that? Wow. Guaranteed to hit him. Nice. Nice. Yes. Oh. And he's had a bomb to spare. Oh, I did not think that was gonna hit him. I was like, if I don't hit this, it's over. Cause those legs come out so fast. Yes, they do, and they are so hard. It takes what all six lanterns to destroy them, doesn't it? Yeah, or three in the case of the tor uh, the Falcon. You oh, have right. to have I a forget. full three charge. That's what I forget that it's equivalent to a six charge for a tornado. And now Virvius 2. And there's no dialogue in this version, is there? No, you don't get dialogue in real mode uh, in the real game. <sighs> no, you don't get a bomb. Oh. Great. Well, you have one. Oh, did you save? Mm-hmm. Oh, my God! Holy shit. Oh, wrong load. Got to be an easy way to freaking blow up those mouths. Oh my god. Take it easy, Tank. Have a good night, man. Good night, Tank. Dude, how the fuck are you gonna blow up those mouths? Wrong Virbius. I don't know, man. Wrong Virbius. Wrong oh load. right, wrong Virbius. I'm I got so used to loading save uh save nine, and not save eight. Cause you need to get like a good, full three lantern shot in on one of those mouths, but you can't do that because you can't charge. Okay, all right, strategy time. What are we gonna do? Well, you get one bomb, so when he goes to open all five of those mouths, that would probably be the best time to use it. Because then you can do damage to all five mouths and get a charge shot. Everything will freeze. You might be able to get a three lantern in on one of those mouths and take it. Damn, I don't remember. I figured mouths. it out. I don't nope, remember wrong those one. mouths being that fragile. Uh, he's a bit more fragile in this game. So that gives me an idea. That gives me an opening. Nope, too soon. The plant from Little Shop of Horrors? Honestly, I don't know. Too soon.
Oh, I remember those eyes being really fucking hard to hit, too. You even do to that? Like, what are you supposed to do? <laughs> nice. Okay, I gotta really. This is gonna be very close. Oh, he went... Oh, he corrected his direction at the last moment. I wasn't expecting... I was expecting him to continue to trail off. I fired that so early. That was so early. That's what she said. I like how he just keeps functioning like it's no big deal that he's missing an entire mouth. Ass, mouth, face, I don't know, something. I cannot believe you freaking blocked all that. It's not over yet, though. Nope. Oh, man. This is going to be interesting. This is going to be interesting. Too early. I need to wait to about a half charge before firing, because I need to catch it as soon as it opens so I have time to block everything. There's so many damn bullets. I wonder if I take this one out. Oh, that's still hurting. Nice direction change, Virvius. I like how his fucking windshield wipers on his face.
getting there. I'm slowly working him down. Fuck. Well, that's the end of that one. I tried to go for that little eyeball to the side, and I went off the window. I wish I could lock it to the window, honestly. Nope, too soon. One last thing. Oh, you got the eye? I got the eye on the left. That's fine. It's something. It does a little bit of damage, too, doesn't it? Got the other eye! Oh my god, he just mercied me. Oh my god.
Got the bottom mouth! Got the third mouth! No! No! Fucking serious. Retro Gamer Rye Guy, what's up? Dude, yeah, me too. I'm bummed that it never got any attention past what it did. I miss the mouth. Oh, man. Man, my eyes are watering because I had to keep them open, bleeding for attention. Man, taking out that mouth right away really does help mm -hmm. a lot. It helps thoughts. out a lot. Makes it a lot easier to defend, and you do a good chunk of damage. Holy crap. Oh! Oh, that was so damn close. Because of the amount of slowdown, that was probably closer to four minutes. Too much. <sighs> it's like a light gun version of Toho Project. No kidding. Fortunately, everything seems to take like one bullet each. Oh, I didn't get that. Whatever. That's a good opening, though. Take out that mouth immediately. That's a really good opening. Yeah, I think that's probably the best way you can open. I mean, that's like fucking kicking the door in and going in guns and fucking blazing. And then if you can hit that mouth right afterwards. You got an eye. Well, the good book says does say an eye for an eye, so you better watch your fucking eyes. Nope. It's just a slow, tedious fight. It's not necessarily hard. It's just you gotta be aware of everything going on. There definitely is a lot fucking going on. What, like six damn eyes and four? He's got four five. in the corners of his mouth. Two off to the side. Uh oh. Oh god. Oh no! The 
<laughs> woke up to the cries of despair. Getting rid of those eyes really helps a lot. Doesn't it actually do a little bit of damage to A little bit, it's not huge. Yeah. Nope, I was like, I can't get rid of them too fast. I can't get rid of them fast enough. You heard of a series called Zero Escape? It's like if Saw was written by Michael Creighton. No, I have not. But you have me intrigued at the word Saw. Oh, Lord. Which I cannot wait for Saw 8 to come out this Halloween. I thought the series was over. It is. Somebody else is going to be carrying on somebody's work. Oh, boy. And it... In the year 2125, Saw 4000. I don't think they'd have 4000 movies by then. Saw 100. Nope. I should have fired it sooner. I knew it was coming. No, I haven't heard about Zero Escape. Got it. Okay, that's a good thing. Son of a bitch. I'll have to check it out. Thanks for the heads up, man. I'm gonna get hit. I took out a corner eye, but I got hit in exchange for it. The right eye is always harder to hit than the left one for some reason. That was so close. Got a bottom mouth. Shh. 
I'm gonna get hit. 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 Out. Shit. The luckiest shot, I swear. But, he's going in a pattern, if you're noticing. He's always going upwards. I need to not do that. I waited a little too late. If you want to go on to sleep, I can just always show you the finishing of it later. It's true. I don't think I'm going to do that. <sighs> Part of me just wants to just crash out here because I don't want to go sleep with a freaking half inflated air mattress. <sighs> no, what? Ah, oh, lucky shot. Is that what you get if Lucky Strike started making whiskey? I guess. You do know what Lucky Strike is, right? It's uh, an alcohol. No, Lucky Strike is a cigarette. Oh. oh. I know why I thought it, you said... Old, crusty, filterless cigarettes. I know why I was thinking it was a, an alcohol, because you said shots. Yeah. Now, if Lucky Strike started making alcohol, they could call it Lucky Shots. Yeah, I'm going to bed. Okay. Have a good night. Yep. Good luck. Thanks. I'll need it. I know. Oh, trust me, I know. Wrong one. Whew. Oh my god. Yeah.
It's such a long, drawn-out fight. Got it. Okay, that's good. You f fuck. And there he goes. No! Four hours. I've been an hour just on various forms one and two.
just missed it. Fuck, I can't believe I just uh, saved it. I'm dead, though. I'm dead! <laughs> oh. oh, my God. Metroid's okay. I like some of the Metroid series. I do not like the original. Take it easy, Cal. But yeah, I like the uh, Metroid series. I like some of the later titles for sure. Metroid Fusion is my favorite one. So many bullets. Oh my god, got it.
almost. Nope, so close, so close, so close. Got it, okay. That helps a little bit. I just threw it away. I just threw it away. Just miss that stupid eyeball. Got the stupid eyeball.
I didn't even blow up all the mouths either. <clears throat> I'll be back. Yeah, I'm going to take a small breather after that. I mean, I could not look at chat at all for that whole time. Like, it wasn't that I was ignoring you. There was no period where I could take my eyes off that screen. So in the meantime, I'm going to change my coil out on my uh, vapor cigarette. That was way, way too intense. I'm gonna help I remove it off the thing first. There we go. Dude, I am blowing this out of the water. I was not expecting this at all, Boleslav. I was expecting to get cornered at Thanatos for quite some time, and then slowly pick apart the others. But this is not... This is taking a much shorter time than I was estimating. I may just go the whole distance and beat the whole thing tonight. Depending on how Gigadesp goes. I have two bombs for Gigadesp. Hey, Zeo. I'm taking a small breather at the moment. How you doing, man? Welcome to the stream. Or should I say at this point, welcome to the madhouse. Yeah, I, I know that feeling, man. I'm trying to get third time, or third time. I'm trying to get full time with my job, too. I'd like to get full time custodial work. What do you do exactly, if you don't mind me asking? If you want to keep that, a, you know, to yourself, I'm totally, I totally respect that. Vengeful Nemesis, thank you so much for the host. 
Vengeful, you missed it, dude. You can ask chat. I just spent the last 45 minutes or so in, like, the most intense firefight. Dude, that'd be great. Tsuki Omaru Zero, thank you so much for the follow. You're now an honorary mantoid in the fight against evil. Thank you so much, man. I'm at, like, the last fight, Vengeful, was so intense, I'm actually declaring a breather. I did not take my eyes off the screen. I just, I've used the phrase a couple times tonight. But they were bleeding from attention. And I'm almost ready to finish this, this challenge tonight. Like, this is going to be a one-streamer. I was not expecting this game to be a one-stream game. But that all depends on how Gigadest decides he wants to behave. Yes, against evil. Because Mantoids, Mantoids are pure at heart normally. Spending 20 minutes is how to get a chest in La Mulan. And yes, breather. It was that intense. I got up, went to the bathroom, decided I'd change out stuff on my uh, vapor cigarette. It was intense. Okay, that should be in there right. Ugh. Normally sane. <laughs> Most of them, yes. <sighs> okay, Vengeful. You've seen me speedrun Battle Clash, right? Okay, so the last boss in Battle Clash, this is the sequel to Battle Clash. Last boss in Battle Clash is an absolute nightmare, like in normal play. He's got uh, four mouths that you have to attack. Two upper mouths that look like giant shoulders, and then two lower mouths that look like snake-like worm things, right? In this one, it's two smaller shoulders, and then these two massive mouths down in the bottom. And each one of them fires... It looked like Lightscope Toho. Like, it literally looked like Lightscope Toho. He fires so many shots. Like, I could not look away. No, it is that chaotic. Since I saved it here, I'll go back and I'll do one fight. So you guys can actually see it. Um... I just need to fill this thing up first. This is really hard to fill up. The bottle is not squishy at all. It's like trying to squeeze a hammer. Just because you guys are just joining. 
Dude, Dodon Pachi Daifukatsu is serious shit, man. Alright, let's see if this will work. Toho can get interesting, though, but Toho is like the staple trope. we go let's take that I have actually not heard of that one the ones I'm most familiar with are by cave all right I'm gonna save this again and make sure save game position six so this is the boss in question, right? This is the one I just beat. And this is how serious this fight gets. Okay, so you know how, how good the SNES was of a console? You ever seen one slow to a crawl? Take it easy, Averick.
That's what I mean. Now try doing that no damage. That's what I had to deal with. I have two bombs. That's what I need for this guy. Nope. So the whole point of this fight, and the reason I need two bombs, is to kill all the eyes that are around him. In the dark, mind you, because I can't see what the hell I'm hitting. And then nail him with a three lantern shot before he hits me. Because it's an instant kill. Even if I wasn't playing a no damage run. Well, that was not what I meant to do. I accidentally cursored one too many times. <clears throat> this is the last big hurdle if I can beat this guy it's the game is pretty much done <gasps> no I just missed him You have one shot to hit him. You can stall him out with a bomb because it clears his shot, but you can't kill him with it. Also, that one bomb took out all the eyeballs. That made me happy. No! He countered my shot. I didn't get a charge fast enough. This is, this is literally going to be the whole fight. I hope y'all are ready to see this over and 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 over. I hit him! I hit the fucker! It's, 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 are, are we actually gonna one-shot this whole challenge in one video? I can't believe I hit him. I actually hit him. Feels like it's dry. I don't know why. Shit. 
shouldn't be. Whatever. Zangoku da Tenshi no Yoni! I have probably butchered the shit out of that. This is it! The final boss! Alright. So the goal is to get the best ending. That's the hardest way to do this fight, is to get the best ending. So let me show you the gimmick to the fight before I actually get in on this, right? So if you try and fight him normally and you fire charge shots, right? Yeah, he just absorbs it. Also, if you take the uh, bad ending, that's what happens. That's the bad ending. And then, the worst ending is if you lose to him and kill the other one. Um, yeah, don't shoot the angel, essentially. Uh, so here's the quick rundown. The one here in the middle, it's struggling. That is the ST Spica, standing tank known, uh, called Spica. Piloted by, uh, Roll, yeah, Roll Carol, or Rolla Carol. And, uh, she actually helps you along through the story mode. And she is a member, she's actually of the same race of the alien invasion, but she is one of the ones rebelling against them. So she comes to Earth... To basically try to get set up so she can help stop the invasion. So if you kill her and then Mike dies, your pilot, you get the worst ending. If either Mike or uh, Rolla die, you get the bad ending. And if you save both of them, you get the best ending. So we're going for the best ending. Those take quite a few shots to down. He just... Those shots take a lot to destroy, so I'm going to have to figure that out. Stream, bitches. That's it. Thanks a lot, friend. I really do appreciate the fact you were able to defeat Gigadesp and save me. Not everyone could do what you have done. You are an expert ST gunner, a marksman. Return now to Earth. Return as a hero. 
Return as my hero. Way to go, Ultima! It seems I chose my partner well. I wonder if we'll ever see Rola or another Eltorian again. Let's go now. Let's go home. Oh. I was not expecting this to be one stream. I think that breather after Virvius really helped me clear my head. Because I knew once I got past Virvius, I was like, okay, the only wall left is Gigadesp, and that's all about hitting him with one shot. Because it's a one-shot fight. Uh, I don't know. <clears throat> I don't know. I might stream. I don't know. Um, But I'm definitely going to let this play out. Actually, you know what? I think I'll do a regular playthrough of this now. And just enjoy the damn game. Like, fuck. <laughs> I wasn't expecting the Giga Death Bite to go that smoothly either. Um, Alien Vendetta will start either tomorrow night or Wednesday or Thursday night because I've got something planned for Tuesday night already. Tuesday's the 4th of July. So what I'm going to do on Tuesday, I'm going to stream G.I. Joe, a real American hero for the NES. I'm going to stream G.I. Joe, the Atlantis Factor for the NES. And I'm probably going to play some Broforce, because those are like the three most American games I can think of. So, that's what I'll be doing for uh, 4th of July. Um, G.I. Joe, fuck yeah, dude. I'm going to slink in my chair here a little bit. By the way, Rolla's Scream has her own credits. Uh, yeah, well, Duke Nukem, I didn't think about that one. I could stream some Duke Nukem if I finish within a reasonable time the others, but Broforce will take me a while. <coughs> I could stream a little bit of Duke Nukem, I guess. Depends on how long I go. I am off Wednesday, so I can stream into the wee hours and not have to worry about being tired. Bro Force is good. I'd suggest getting it. Do you want to try for a co-op, Quacken? Or, I don't know, can you do internet co-op? I'm gonna move this out of the way. You can rest now, little mouse cursor. There's only one challenge left in this game, by the way. I now have to repeat this process with the tornado. But that's for another incentive. Well, the question is, uh, I know it's up to four people. I've played Broforce over at my friend Ben's. Um, Hannibal, as you guys might know him a little bit better now. That's his internet handle, is uh, or internet name, whatever. Garam5808. Now we get to go through. See, this is the cool thing about this game. And the previous, like, Battle Clash. It goes through all of the uh, STs that you defeat. And it gives you the time, and it adds them all up, and it gives you the in-game time. That would be cool. I should check that out. I can't believe Griffin went down that easy. 
Fucking so damn easy. Yeah, it's gonna get foggy in here. I'm enjoying the fuck out of this thing right now. Check this out. So, I got some juice. I found it. It's fucking strawberry jam on buttered toast. Like, how do you do that? Fuck you, Arachnus. <coughs> this will be the fastest time I've ever had on real mode high, just to let you know. But I had to use save states because I, I knew I'd be reloading every single time I got hit, so... I kind of actually labels in Virvius 1. <coughs> Again, just a reminder, I'm like $111.77 away from Mega Man X 700%. 12 fucking seconds. God. So what was my in-game time? Let's find out. 13.50! I am a cyclone! Colonel class. Mmm! Yeah, no, dude. I will definitely let you know, Admiral. I just don't know if I'm going to start it tomorrow night or if I'm going to wait until after uh, 4th of July to start it. I might actually do a fucking casual stream tomorrow and I get myself a little bit of a breather. And of course, obviously, I guess 4th of July would be a casual stream too, but it's more themed, so. Boom! Congratulations! You are extraordinary! Way to go, buddy. Now you've really done it. Sharpen your skills to rank even higher.